Hello, it is July, which means we have a new Dragon of the Month to add to our collections. The Musical Dragon is a legendary light and shadow dragon, which really isn't too bad of an elemental combo for a legendary, an easier sumo dragon basically. Anyway, to breed the wondrous Musical Dragon, you'll need to breed together two dragons that have the four following elements, earth, wind, plant, and water. As always with Dragons of the Month, there are many possible combinations you could use. However, I have broken it down to the three best combos to use for all players. Number one, Plant plus Clownfish. This is a great combination that gives about a 4.17% chance of breeding the Musical Dragon if you've already bred the Special Dragon Collector and VIP Dragons. Just five other possible outcomes with the highest being an eight hour breed, Definitely recommend everyone to use this combination if they can. Number two, Earth plus Elixir. Another good combo giving a 3.7% chance of breeding musical if you've bred the other special dragons. You can also use dragons with the same elements such as the Go Green, Nurture, Springtime or Sprite dragons and the breed will work just as well. It also gives you the chance to breed the Clownfish Dragon, meaning if you breed it by accident, then you can move and use combo one instead. Number three, Snow plus Seed. This is a good combination for newer players that don't have the Clownfish or any epics yet. Still gives a solid 2.78% chance of breeding musical after specials have been bred, and also the chance to breed the Clownfish. So this is a really good beginner combo. So those are the best combos you should be using, but don't forget, it is important to level up your breeding dragons when breeding for rarer dragons like Dragons of the Month. Reason being that the higher your dragon levels are, the higher your odds are of breeding the musical dragon. I would normally suggest for you to level your dragons to level 15 minimum, but that is only if you have the food easily available to do so. Also. Rebreeding as often as you can is going to help you out tremendously. If we take a look at a drop chance calculator to put this in perspective, on average, at a 4.17% chance of being bred, it is expected to take about 54 breeds before you get the Dragon of the Month. That would give you about a 90% probability. But this isn't taking into account boosted odds from leveling up your dragons. At 20 rebreeds, you've got a 57.34% chance of having bred musical at least once. So use these numbers to gauge how your breeding luck is going this month. Oh my god, on my first try. It's literally my first try and I already have the dragon of the month. One try, I did not expect that to happen. That was a complete accident. Um, well, I'd say that that was pretty lucky. Anyway, I hope you get the Musical Dragon and any other breeds or event dragons that you want this month. Although I will say, be mindful of when you're breeding legendaries because you do not want to stilt your ancient event progress by clogging up your breeding den. So choose your times to breed wisely.